Hey everyone, so in my last video, I showed you how to create a Facebook page to, um, to, to build your following on Facebook and to share cool tips and uh, you know drive traffic back to your website and that sort of thing. Um, in this one, I want to show you actually how to add a link over on your page. Um, if you see on my page here over in the left, uh, right below my little logo, you can see businessandblogs.com. Now if I click on businessandblogs.com, it just automatically redirects the user over to my website. It's not super fast, but it when they click on it, it redirects them over to my website as soon as they click on it. Um, so what I want to do is I want to show you how to create a redirect like that on your page. Okay, so let's um, let's go to this WP Cash Cow page that we made in our last video. Obviously, I haven't done anything with it. We don't have any images or anything, but I want to add a little link back to the WP Cash Cow over in my left sidebar here. So what I want to do is I want to install an application that's going to do that for me. So I'm going to come up here to search and I'm going to type static, let's see, static iframe tab. You can see it's this third one that it dropped down. So I'm going to click on the static iframe tab and then it's going to ask me to continue as Matt Wolf. This is my personal profile. So I'm going to go ahead and click continue. Let's give it a second. Um, and then I'm going to click install page tab. It's going to ask me which page I want to install it on, so I'm going to select the WP Cash Cow, which is the one we just created. I'll go ahead and click add static iframe tab. And now you can see it created this little box here that says welcome. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and click on this welcome. And it should bring me some options here. It's loading a little slow. Um, I'm kind of doing some stuff in the background, so it's making things load, load a little bit slower than I like. But um, down here you can see where it says page source, and it says URL redirect image HTML. Let's go ahead and click redirect, and it says this user's entire browser window will leave your page tab and redirect them to the URL you specify. So I want them to redirect to the WP Cash Cow. So I'll go ahead and put the URL in there, the WPCashCow.com. And I'm pretty much going to leave everything the same, except I'm going to come down here to tab name, and instead of welcome, I want it to say the WP Cash Cow. Okay, so I'll just, just name, give it the name of the website. You can name it whatever you want. You could write um, a link to my page or whatever. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and click Save Settings. It's going to load here for a second. Settings have been saved. Now if I go look on my wall here, you can see it added this link that says the WP Cash Cow. If I click on it, it's going to ask me, basically it's going to ask me if I want to be redirected, but it only does that for admins. It's only going to do that for me because I'm logged in right now. Everybody else it's going to automatically redirect. So I'll go ahead and click OK. And even though my stuff's going really slow, it should eventually redirect to the WP Cash Cow. So there we go obviously a little bit slower than we like that's just because I'm rendering a different video in the background right now so let's go back to Facebook and um, let me log out as admin of this one so now I'm logged in as the admin of business and blogs let me go back to my WP cash cow main page here now I'm, I'm not logged in as the admin and you can see I lost some options here but if I click on the WP Cash Cow, it's just going to redirect me. So that's how you add a redirect link onto your Facebook sidebar page. Pretty simple. So go ahead, get your Facebook page started, and add those, um, those links back to your pages. Um, as far as I know, you can add as many as you want. Um, I personally like to make one Facebook page per website that I do, so I'm only going to ever have one link really, um, but that's how I do it. So that's it. If you want more tips on social media, Facebook, blogging, uh, affiliate marketing, all that kind of stuff, I teach all of that at my blog, businessandblogs.com. You can find a link right below this video for businessandblogs.com. Tons of tips, tons of uh, good ideas to get an online business going, all free stuff. Um, so check it out. Hope you enjoy it. That's businessblogs.com. I'll see you on my blog. Hope to see you commenting. Cool. See you guys later.